With three young boys aged three years and younger, there isn't a dull day in the Zinzer home. But days like this one won't be around for much longer. After living in the Diocese of Brooklyn for all their lives, the Zinzer family is leaving. Are you excited to go? Yeah. I don't think they understand, but it will sink in as soon as we, <laughs> we get there. The family is packing their car and driving over 10 hours to Detroit, Michigan. There, they will live out their vocation as a missionary family. It's called Missio Agenda, so we go to uh, a place where the church is very weak or almost non-existent, and we bring the church to the people not through the building, but through, the, our, through our families. The family belongs to the Neo-Catechumical Way, a charism dedicated to Christian formation. They are one of hundreds of families being sent out around the world to bring the good news of Jesus Christ. We'll go door to door. Um, uh, sometimes, sometimes we'll go to, to public areas and pray, uh, give give witness talks or our, our experience of faith. The family has been discerning their new vocation for the past two years, even going on a retreat in Italy to learn God's call. It was the word of God that helped them decide, as they were given the instruction to pick out a gospel passage at random to pray. And it, the gospel that came up was the call of Levi. So it was to go drop everything that you have and come follow me. Of course, for the Zinzers, that isn't so easy. Their oldest son, Matthew, and youngest son, Ignacio, have rare disorders that require regular blood tests and monitoring. Still, the Zinzers are excited for their new trip and the challenges ahead. You know, we're, we're nervous, you know, yes, we're leaving all this behind, but we also see the need for this mission, and um, there really is nothing greater uh, than to announce the gospel. The family will leave the first week of September. Reporting for Currents, I'm Katie Angusser.